Yo, we're back in Night City. Let's go. I'm all too familiar with your kind. What do you mean, your kind? I can be anything you want me to be. Okay. Yes, sorry, Jackie. I got distracted. Someone just freaking disappeared. But you are not the masters of your memories. For your eyes do not belong to you, or rather, not only. Is that like you. the new version of a tinfoil hat? Do you truly a believe bag that those who have sold tunic? you your mechanical eyes have resisted the temptation? Yeah, yeah, sorry. Them? Cameras are all around us, even ooh, within us. Ooh, la la. Your okay. Joys, your worries, your life. Hey V. Hi. Dr. Vector will see you now. I'll sit tight over here. Me and Misty got a little catching up to do. Oh. You look pleased. You flirt. Cause I am. Always. Makes for easier living. Cameras are Let's but save the <laughs> We got a new job lined up. <laughs> Brag about the new job. <gasps> Kitty! Yeah! Oh, he's so cute! I want to pet you more. Yes. Yeah. He's so cute. I'm happy. Best game ever. You take care of that kitty. The long drops is guard. Uh, you can see the fatigue on him. It's 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 Ricky's Oh whoa. Okay, Ripper Dog. Ripper Ripper Dog. Though a common practice cyberware installation is still a dangerous and invasive procedure which can only be performed by qualified specialists. Ripper Dogs. There are several Ripper Dogs operating through Night City who offer a variety of different cyberware upgrades. Select your desired cybernetic upgrade from the list and enjoy your new abilities. I guess. Where you old Ripper? Good to see you. Yeah, locked them with some points or something. Good to see you too, V. Oh wow. Ooh. To what do I owe the pleasure today? You have a smooth Last voice. Last gig had to jack into a client's neuro socket. Think I might have gotten spiked. Experiencing migraines, nausea, hypersensitivity to bright lights. Oh, kit and caboodle. All right, kit. We'll sort you out in a flash. Besides that, how are things? Um. Met a new fixer. Gave me a job. Name's Dexter Deshawn. Known quantity from the afterlife. No denying you're moving up. But. Something you're not telling me, Vic? Yeah, I'm not sure if that's a good thing. Keep your guard up, that's all. I've heard some things about Dex. He's not as chill as he makes himself out to be. Need some new kit, but tools, not toys, Vic. Time I bumped up my sights and got a grip. <laughs> really? Now? Finally? Vic, shit's getting real. Got a job from Dex to Sean, hitting the major leagues. Need tech that can perform. The Dexter Deshaun? Spooky monkey. Uh, well, that is something. But let me guess. <clears throat> Hasn't paid you yet. Uh. Quit crying, Vic. I'll bring you the Eddies later with interest. You know I will. Hmm. Last time. You hear? Okay. What was that? Why are you not reacting? Chill, please. Sit down and relax. Oh, I'll be able to do that with a voice like that. What? Dude, what is that? Karoshi Optics. Best I've got and should be about right under the circumstances. Be gentle. Now check in. You peruse and choose while I scan. Whoa. See what's going on inside. Peruse 
Roots and shoes. Oh, what upgrade I want. Pants are locked. Face. Better eyes. Basic Kiroshi optics. Oh. Ooh, I get more snaky. I'm more healthy. Alright. Uh, cyberware capacity, 15 out of 27. Indicates the amount of cyberware your body can handle. This limit increases as you level up, acquire certain perks and use cyberware capacity shards. Perks increasing cyberware capacity. Edge runner, renaissance punk. View in perk tree. Can't do that right now. Um. Um, did I upgrade it? No. Now I did, right? Okay. That's upgraded to tier 1. Then I can click the hands. Increase ricochet chance with power weapons. Directly links the user optical implant to the weapon system, offering real-time weapon info. Wow, okay. And reload speed, okay. I guess so. Into commentary system. Subdermal armor. Cool. Yes. We want to be a bit tanky. We're going for strength build. Okay. What's happening? Okay, we unlocked a lot more now. Circulatory system. Stamina and health regeneration. <clears throat> this is sneak. Armor and overall defense. Power. Oh, okay, so we have to unlock those. We don't have anything yet. What is this? This is equipped operating system. Okay, that's our scanner thing. Okay, we can buy these from him, I guess. The sound just disappeared there. Okay. Ah, okay. I saw the blue dot finally. Movement speed when your health drops. Okay, and we can buy that, right. Um, there was another one here. Okay, but these are too expensive. Plus 15% damage against drones, robots, mechs and turrets. I guess that's nice. Um, circulatory system. All oh, right, okay, we didn't take them off yet. Yeah, I figured we could upgrade these as well. Okay, I have no idea what to prioritize, but we'll figure it out. Uh, that's it, I guess. Mark one, like I said, decent enough scanner. Displays data on your cornea. Cherry on the tops of built-in external lens disruptor. 
In layman's terms, any surveillance cam will capture your faces a blur. And just remember, your body will still show up as crystal clear. Hmm. This should do the trick. Talks to Kuroshi Tech, too. I'm ready. Carve away. Excellent. Let's do this. I'm scared. Lay that major league arm of yours right here. So, what's new in the life of Victor Vector? <sighs> yeah, if I'm being honest, not much. And that's fine with me. I used to live in a world where all that mattered was who's who, what's what, and how's why. And what happened? One day, I just dropped it and never looked back. I'll never be a legend in this town, but been sleeping nights ever since. Hmm. Let's do this. Just like that. Thanks. You're welcome, I guess. Now, a bit of anesthetic and I can start cutting. Ow. Feel anything? Play-by-play, -play, though? <laughs> really, Doc? Makes you sound like a dentist, always going on and on. Don't be mean now. Remember, I'm old. I got a shaky gannic hand. Could slip. <laughs> Lights out for a minute, all right? Okay. Ooh. Give me chills. Okay, let's test this. See the magic in action. Mm. Linking you in. You might feel a little discomfort at first. Blurred vision, low contrast, glitches. Uh, what are you doing? Oh. Well, how's it look? Feel all right to you? Oh, this is fantastic, Vic. <laughs> oh, beautiful. Uh, scanning people with your optical cyberware can provide you with lots of useful information, such as how strong an enemy might be, who is in their crew, or what type of weapon they use. As a skilled netrunner, you can see a list of quick hacks which you can use against your enemy. Yeah, I knew that. Time for the scanner. Oh, uh. It might take you a few seconds to adjust, but first time's rarely the charm, with anything, really. Scanner should eventually sync with your thought processes and read your intentions. I also inject an NCPD file search. Run into any ne'er-do-wells? <laughs> you know exactly what they ne'er did well. Mm-hmm. A database of individuals with bounties assigned to them is now available to use. You can identify these wanted persons with your scanner. Since all want, since all are wanted, dead or alive, these the methods you use to claim your reward are entirely up to you. <laughs> it ought to work like a charm. That will depend on the person. Now I draw your weapon. You should see your ammo count in a brand new site. How about the neurovirus from the last job? Can you check it? Done and gone while we were putting in your implant. And a full sweep on your soft and circuits. Zap the critter. You're certified bug free. Great. Shit, Victor, not bad. I don't know what to say. Say you'll take this and remember the dosage. Two whiffs now and another two in an hour. Okay. What am I looking at? A mild stem should boost neurotransmission in the short term and muffle some of the side effects while the implant takes. All okay. right. You're the best, Vic. I owe you. <laughs> Go on, kid. Show them what you're made of. Well, these animations are so and realistic. And once you hit the big leagues, don't forget where you came from. 
I think he's a boxing fan. He also had a boxing glove uh, pendant on his neck. Who's winning? Who's winning? Hernandez. You know, in the old days, that cripple Malone would have been flat on the boards. Now every last fighter's got extra skull lining. Absorb 75% <laughs> of every blow. Got cash riding on this? Nah, just looking. <laughs> it's out of habit more than anything else. Random uh, quest update. <laughs> Another one. Less loud. Miss it, don't you? Ah. Uh. Yeah, I figured he was an ex-boxer. Or just... Um... Yeah, destroying your stuff, apparently. Oh, big space. Ah, uh, it's a, a boxing, uh... Report. Kazuo Kano's name, okay. We'll see after Malone takes his revenge on Hernandez. But Hernandez is winning right now, so uh Yeah. Alright, let's go back to Jackie. Thanks, Doc. Yeah. <gasps> Kitty! Yeah. Pretty kitty. Hey Jackie, are you done flirting? Your heart chakra looks a little out of whack, babe. <clears throat> I can release it for <clears throat> you, but you'd have to watch out for negative energy fields uh. and avoid mean reds. Mm -hmm. Anything red. <sighs> Thanks, Miss V. Yo, listen up. Psst. I talked to Dex while you were in with the doc. He's waiting in his ride for you. Ain't but a hop to where he's parked next to Gramsci Burgers. Okay, do my best to talk us up. Uh, yeah, have fun with, uh, Misty here. But you are not the master. How's business, oh, wow. <laughs> Boomin? <sighs> You're the first person to walk oh, in here sorry. for two days. And two days ago, it was a pizza guy. Got lost. People in this town, they've lost their spiritual connection. But well, you know, I'm here to serve them, not the other way around. Okay. You can, it's okay to let your girl let yourself get served once in a while what are you oh regina v listen Again. i've got this delicate matter that's why i called you the number of cyber psycho attacks in the city is on the rise now that's probably not news to you but this issue matters to me for a few oh. reasons <clears throat> there are people who say cyber psychosis can be treated right and i know exactly how that sounds but i believe even an unproven therapy is still better than a bullet to the brain if I get a tip about a possible attack, I'll give you a call. Maybe you can investigate before Max Tack hits the scene. Mm. But remember, you're not there to execute anybody. Try to incapacitate the attacker, mm. and I'll send someone to pick him up. I hope that's all clear. Hmm. Okay. There are various ways to incapacitate enemies without killing them. Non-lethal takedowns, non-lethal quick hacks, weapons, EMP grenades, and some combat gadgets. Weapon mods that can change damage to null lethal. Give a weapon a combat. Uh, if a given weapon, combat gadget, or quick hack deals non lethal damage, it will be mentioned in the description. Thanks. And the. 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 the middle mouse button Do thing you updated. Do believe that those who have sold you your mechanical eyes have resisted the temptation mm -hmm. to seek for them? Where? What the hell? Why did they run away? What's happening? Oh my god. There he is. Jeez, okay, here we go. Don't let them wait. 
Yo. Yo, Miss V. A pleasure. Dexter Deshaun in the flesh. Ample indeed. <laughs> let's roll. Yeah, let's. Mind if I ask you something right off the bat? No, go ahead. Would you rather live in peace as Miss Nobody, die ripe, old, and smelling slightly of urine, uh. or go down for all times in a blaze of glory smelling near like posies without seeing your 30th? I'd like to see my 30th, thank you. Um, Miss V? It's first place or no place, Dex. Cost isn't a factor. <laughs> Classic. I'd expect nothing less from eager, supple youth. Respect. Supple? <laughs> Alright, listen close. Scanning a serious job now. Sure. Playing gargantuan compared to smashing up a scav home. Mm. Let me hear it. What's the job? There's this prototype tech. A biochip, to be precise. Jobs to grab it. Simple. Hmm. Guessing it belongs to a corp? Mm-hmm. Arasaka. Surely that's no problem. Corps don't deserve special treatment. Shit. <laughs> you ain't playing around. Got a feeling this could be a start of a beautiful friendship built on heaps of eddies. You work this out? Got a plan? Two things. First, a conundrum with the Maelstrom boys. Needs active resolving that. Second, a rendezvous. Simple. Klein who brought us the job's anxious. She wants to parlay with one of the team. Tell me about her. Klein. What's her thing? Why she need to meet? Woman's name's Evelyn Parker. Betting her wasn't easy. Put the word out I was looking for any kind of intel. Right, and? Some brothers from Pacifica got back to me. Told me to stop looking. End of convo. <laughs> anyway, our little client insisted on meeting someone with skin in the game. You know, who'll be there for it all. Mm -hmm. Yours truly will be remote. T-Bug ain't no people person, and Jaggy's only good at some things. I know you know what I mean. Pretty much leaves you. What's the issue needs resolving with Maelstrom? Got a beef? Slot in the shard. Got a classic tale for you. Psycho Gang doing his thing two weeks back. Jumped a Militech convoy. Got away with the gear. Corp don't even know Maelstrom's involved. Now see, convoy was carrying the flathead. A little combat bot, a prototype. And I need me that bit of high-grade military tech. Why? Because if we don't get that bot, we don't get no soccer chip. And we sure as hell don't get no happily ever after. But don't get excited. It's a single-use toy. Okay. Now, I flat out purchased the damn thing from Maelstrom. Problem is, I did so from a gent went by the name of Brick. I say when, because Brick was the leader. Three days after we'd sealed our deal, his friend and gangmate, one Simon Randall, AKA Royce, plain dropped his ass. Royce is in charge now, and I got no way of knowing if he aims to honor his predecessor's word. To add to this shipstrom, one Meredith Stout of Militech has developed an interest in said convoy. Who's the prima donna? Corpo agent, internal affairs. Been skidding around town asking after the convoy as if her life depended on finding it. The one lead she's got zip tied in her trunk. Stick up her ass ain't growing any shorter. So she must be getting desperate. Be wise to think how you could use that. Of course, to do so, you'll need that frazzled cat's info. Sending it now. Think I got everything. Time I got to work. Well, that's just music to my ears. I'll set up the meet with Miss Parker at Lizzie's bar. Flathead, though, is gonna be all you. Okay. Oh, cool.
here for the roleplay, so I'm not gonna skip the ride. It's a bit of an awkward silence, though. Can you not talk about small things? One more thing, Miss V. Things? Quiet life or a blaze of glory? Hmm? Am I not supposed to answer that? Later now. Yo. Performing certain actions will reward you with street cred. Oh, leveled up. Uh, build your street cred to make a name for yourself in the city, in the night city on the world. Doing so will open up new opportunities. <laughs> Jackster, talk to Dex. <laughs> yeah, Gordito's a big deal. Literally a nine, yeah. Me out, Guy certainly knows how to protect his biz. Wants to put us on a few small kinks. Prep work. I have to I think. Guess, Sorry, Jack. Before lining us up a big job. There's this combat bot military prototype. Maelstrom clipped it. Then Dex paid to take it off their hands just before the gang goons had a switch up in management. I right. Heard about that. Royce versus Brick. Hostile takeover. About sums it up. Dex wants us talking to Royce. Gave the deeds of some Militech agent, too, but don't know how much help she stands to be. Ha! <laughs> Chingon. Yeah, he don't sound thrilled. Royce, what do you know about him? He's fucking whack something special. Mm. Junkie snort junk. Mm -hmm. Royce snorts chrome. Okay. Then there's the other thing. Gotta meet the client who put the job on the table. Evelyn Parker. You? Well, what's Dex gonna do? Ride around in his limo, chat chicks up on the hollow? Parker wants to meet someone on the crew. Dex gave me the nod. I must know what he's doing. So, how you wanna play this? Maelstrom or Parker? What's first? Let's start with the client. Parker. Think I ought to see her first. See what she's like, what she's after. Orale. In that case, I'll hit the all foods. My nose to the ground. Sniff around. I still know where you go. Ah, I see what that was. My translator bleeped out the subtitles, I guess. This game is beautiful. Um, let's go to this. That's far away. And we're gonna walk. Maybe just just occurred to me. Can't start your career in the major leagues right now by sporting some rag of a T-shirt. The wind blows a lot stronger up there on the top of the world. Old timers like me hate to watch you kids catch catch cold. Left you a couple of things in your stash at your apartment. Give them an honest try, and I bet they'll fit you just right. Ah. Uh. Oh, we can call him. Ah, we won't do that. Uh... Miss V, I just wanted to remind you again that ideas have already changed hands between me and my esteemed Milstrom partner in biz. A round sum of 10,000 to be precise, so when you're there to take it off their hands, don't let them try to shake you down, as they are liable to do. Milstrom being Milstrom. Okay. Don't let, don't get shaken down. Biochip info. Miss V, how about a little something to get those taste buds tingling? The biochip in question is, in fact, the so-called rep relic. A Nova tier piece of text catered t tech catering to the top one percent. Supposedly the best life insurance money can buy. You and I are going to be neck deep in euro dollars. Alright. Oh. Sigis on weer as you got the excess waiter. Yeah, okay. Oh, 
Oh, these are my opponents. Kabuki, won't spoil this. Just come and see. Okay. Arroyo, Buck, Sixth, Street Gang, a real piece of shit. Glenn, Cesar, fists like fucking hamsters. Okay, should be easy to beat then, I guess. Four, Animals Club, Rhino, Woman's a Legend. Lays everyone flat. Great, love to meet her. Uh, how do I level up? Oh, I actually need to call? Uh, let's call then. Miss V, their problem? Been wondering. This heist heralded in the triumphant return of Dex to Sean to the fixer's table. <laughs> Gotta admit, a few years from my seat has left me with a bit of an appetite. So you come dropping in with a bang. Deshaun ain't just a name, it's a brain. About time my clientele remember who they do biz with. But you got my word. You don't disappoint, you'll get your cut. With interest. Best get back to work. Be in touch. Alright. It still doesn't cross it off though. Oh, that's why. I had to send it. You'll need it, best of luck. Okay. Uh. I get it now. Haha, <laughs> fair. Uh, anyway, where... Where else would I find a home for these things? Not Misty Style and my punk days are long behind me. Oh, we can call any of them. That's pretty cool. But how do we... Uh, how do we level up? Character? Maybe? Perks available. Three perks available. Three attribute points available. Aha. Uh -huh. Oh boy, that's cool. Okay. Let's go here first, because that's my priority. Uh, I guess we start from the bottom. Vehicles. Very nice. That's... okay. When using butt pumps everywhere, over there, you meet each other. Okay, two seconds. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. Um... Okay, now I get it. Okay. 5% instant recharge of health items and grenades after neutralizing an enemy. Health items and grenades. They recharge? No, I don't have any available. Maybe I should actually like look at these things. Uh, when crouched... Yeah, that's kinda nice. Grants a chance to reduce incoming damage. Yeah. Killer instinct. Okay. We've spent everything we want to, so... 
Okay, we have these two. Which are these skills? Skill prepared headhunter. How do we earn those? I. Oh, yeah. Okay, so the, those are like achievement points for doing stuff. I saw Shinobi when I was doing something with the kata katana earlier. Right. Uh, okay, I get it. Let's go to Lissa's bar. Now we go up here. Oh, yo, yo, yo. No, 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 no. I wonder if we- can we play in third person? Does my stamina not run out from running? That's loud. Hey, you there? Nope. Right. Oh. <gasps> Gangs or something? Okay. Health and okay. Traffic safety? We're just collecting everything. I bet there's achievements for that. I don't know. Let's see. All right. We're closed right now. I'm here for someone. Please. Between 6 p.m. and 6 a.m. Can I wait in this game? What's the time? Oh, okay, so 40 minutes. Rita Wheeler, the mox. Uh, is there an, is there a way to wait? Okay, let's look around for a bit. Please don't drive over me. It's a fast travel thing, that's cool. You can go to a fast travel location, placing your cursor on it and... Alright, but it's fine. Jesus Christ, what's going on there? Drunk driver. Not this. What's what? What happened? Are you alive? And you're not faced by any of this. Someone just committed suicide. Oh. Oh, there's police. Hey, sir, something happened. Okay. Can't tell him. It's just loot stuff. Okay, we'll wait. We can do a KC nice that uh, trans transition while we wait for uh, the 
bar to open. Alright, it's almost 6 p.m. It's 6 p.m. right now. We can go in. Without gun, please. Thank you very much. Hey there, dollface. Yo. Interest you in a preem BD? What do you got? <laughs> what don't we got? Women and men of your dreams. Mm. Synaptic acting A-listers. No washed up virtue porn boy toys or blow up dolls here. Oh, tur stuff. It'll grip your heart and blow your nerves right out of your body. Interesting. Pure bit-based ecstasy. <laughs> That's why people come here. But it barely know how to sell it. Yeah. Not a sales pitch. It's a warning. I'll give you one word. Bespoke. Not for everyone's synapses. Think you can handle it? Uh, another time. You know what? Uh, maybe another time. Sure thing. I'm doll. very tempted though. Or do we need to click yes to continue? Reconsidered, huh? I guess so. Bespoke. Damn, that sounds promising. I get it. I'm in. Mm-hmm. Couple of things you need to know first. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Severe penalties for any unauthorized recording. Fair. No drugs, no groping. Okay. Someone catch your eye? You do not grab them. You find them in the catalog, ask for a BD, and get yourself a box. I really look that green to you. Like I don't know. Mm-hmm. Doors open. Okay. Have fun, doll. I like your hair, Welcome by the way. Welcome to Lizzie's. Yours, too. Oh. My, what a sweet little face. We are in a... What you might call it? A brothel. But then we can order a BD, insert it into our brain, and then live the fantasy, right? Kaboom! That's how that works. Alright. But it's also a dance club, apparently. Beautiful Boulevard. All depends what you're into. Maybe you can tell me about it over a drink. Hey, another round over here, Stat. Hey. Get you something. Um. So, curious, the name Lizzie's, that the owner? Not for a long while, no. And it's none too sweet a story. Mm. Oh, now I'm just flat yeah. interested. You, you gotta tell it. Real Lizzie ran a strip joint out of this place back in the day. Lizzie's bar. Girls were paid right, insured, even had decent security. Good spot, all in all. Till? Let me guess, it didn't last. No, Tiger Claws took care of that. Who's that? Tiger beat one of Lizzie's girls real bad once. No hesitation, Lizzie blasted the guy's balls off. The gang came back the next day. Uh. Liz was done. Tigers gave this place up to the Mox in the end, though, didn't they? Sort of. The Moxes had to make a deal with them. Luckily, they kept their heads organized quick. Mm -hmm. Big boss now is Susie Q. But the sign stayed up, out of respect. Biz booms to this day. Uh, what can I get here? What's on the menu? Drinks. Okay, I don't know anything about this yet. Probably boost some stats. Looking for Evelyn Parker. Know if she's here? Who's asking? Me. Name's V. She and I have a date. Well, V, it's a pleasure. Mateo. Uh-huh. So, Evelyn. Club's big. 
I'm gonna have to look around. Can't do it for you. It's all right, Mateo. He's waiting for this one. Oh, are you Evelyn? Um. Evelyn Parker. I assumed. I knew it was you as soon as you walked in. Tequila. The tequila. The tequila. <laughs> tequila is disgusting. That's though. not. Only tequila I drink. <laughs> How would you know? I like to know everything about the people I work with. Either that or it was just a lucky guess. Oh, I can't do that one. Mind if we talk about the job? Heard you got something for me. Mm. But not here. Come with me. Didn't have to require us. We'll be in the lounge, Mateo. Anyone asks, we're not here. Ooh. We're not here. Bye, Mateo. So, Oops. What nothing's wrong. Really? really? Why don't you just tell me the truth? I just Hello. told you. Oh, private room. What's that? Okay, so he'll yeah. sit. Maybe then grab it. Okay, can't grab it. Okay, ooh. Dex had a load to say about you. Ah. Called you professional, effective, mm -hmm. and trustworthy. I hope he wasn't overselling. Um, no. I'm good at what I do. Got a solid crew at my back, too. Never once botched a job. You do realize I expect more of you than scraping street corner data terms. Much, much more. I'm the best, and I know what I'm getting into. Dex was clear. The job's high risk. Oh, I do have to walk over there. <clears throat> By the way, you work together long? You and Dex? Uh, yeah, ages. <laughs> you write in Dex's bio? Hate to disappoint, but I just don't know much. In other words, you hardly know each other. Mm -hmm. Yet he fingered you for this job. Um, oh. <clears throat> Curious. Uh, I does that mean something else, or does it mean what I think it means? Because that's n not what happened. V? <sighs> Shit, buzz Dex right now if you're getting cold feet. I can wait. I doubt he'd add anything I haven't already heard. Anything I'd really like to hear, for that matter. There's only one other bunch that's worse than fixers in that respect. Used car salesmen. <laughs> I'll go with my gut for now. Okay, let's talk business. Let's cut to the chase. What do you got for me? Thank you. Your target. I trust you know what it is. Relic. Secure your soul trinket. Key tech in the program, actually. We're tangling with Arasaka. Making this heist one dangerous, risky motherfucker. Mm-hmm. Arasaka's poured billions into personality transfer technology. But me... I just want the data on this one. The chip is tucked away inside Compeki Plaza, the hotel. You ever been? You know, just never rolled through that neighborhood. Damn shame. The fresh they serve is sinfully good. Chef must have made a deal with the devil. Mm -hmm. So where's this chip hiding, exactly? In a suite on the top floor. The room's occupied by Yorinobu Arasaka. Yorinobu Arasaka. He's in town? Don't you read the scream sheets? The media couldn't get enough of Yori coming to Night City. It was all over the headlines. You think I care? Anyway, he's heir apparent to the Arasaka Empire. Saburo Arasaka's only surviving son. I guess I have to. What, so Arasaka Jr.'s planning to grab the reins while in Night City? Only a handful of people in Night City know what the Arasaka's real plans are. Telling me you're one of them? Uh. I'm waiting. Top dog like you Nobu's been to have an army on call. Hotel's probably a goddamn fortress by now, too. 
Yorinobu keeps exactly no hustle around. Not one guard. Got rid of them a long time ago. Huh. Why is that? Surely you know what they say about Arasaka Into. Sneeze in Night City, and a blossom drops from a cherry tree in Tokyo. Yorinobu was convinced his Arasaka security detail reported directly to his father. Look, if you've got any spare aces up your sleeve, now's the time to show them. Now this should make your tits perk up. Mm -hmm. Yorinobu recently swiped the chip from an Arasaka laboratory. He's made a deal with Netwatch, aims to sell it to them. Have you spotted my ace yet, or do I need to spell things out? <sighs> Wait, neutral Netwatch is mixed up in this? Netwatch provides net security for all corporations, and collects eddies in the millions for it. But in this day and age, everyone's in the game, and no one can afford to be a saint. To win, one has to go all in. Fine. So no Arasaka security on the device, because Yorinobu whisked it away in secret. Now where's he hiding it? Well, likely in a specialized container. One that mimics an organic neural environment. On the outside, it looks like an ordinary briefcase. And the case is? You'll see for yourself soon enough. Provided we're done gossiping about the Arasakas. What else do you know about Yorinobu? Quite a bit, actually. He studied finance and biotech in Tokyo. <laughs> Probably didn't have a choice in the matter, come to think of it. Saburo was grooming him to be his successor. Mm -hmm. But then Yorinobu vanished to chase his own dreams. Cut himself off from the corp for years. Long story short, though the black sheep returned, the bitter taste remained. But that's only one side of him. There's another. An intelligent man who has always walked his own path. And so has his own designs on the corp. Seems to be risking everything with this relic scam. Yes, because he's fallen for the biggest lie this town puts forward. That he can gain and retain control of anything. Okay, what's next? Now comes the best part. Follow me. Got something for you. Should help you plan. Brain dance from Compeki Plaza. How's a brain dance supposed to help? Need facts, not thrills. Uh oh. I think BDs are only good for fondling virtual tits, jacking off to in those boxes. No, they can be a very useful tool. Good for analyzing details, human perception, even boosted, doesn't grasp exactly what you need. So, what's on the tape? Yorinobu's suite, the glorious interior. You'll need to locate the relic yourself. I hope I grabbed enough Would detail to make that like possible. Anything else? No, 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 I don't want to hear it. Uh, it's a bit... Uh, no, no. Oh boy, what was that? I'm not gonna go back mm. and check. <laughs> what the hell? Uh... <clears throat> Hold up. Mean to say you recorded this? Mm-hmm. BD rec implant. Why, you object? Uh... It's supposed to be Yorinobu's pad on the tape. Means you were inside. You, uh, know each other? How else could I get all this intel? I know him pretty well, actually. We have an arrangement. Strictly business. Suits us both, I think. Uh-huh. Let's see this brain dance. Business with benefits, I guess? Judy will help. She's a mox, too. Besides, we go back, uh, years. Mm. V, this is important. All right. Judy's always been there for me. Always helped out. I trust her. Okay. But she's a mox, not the latest member of your crew. Try not to forget. So you'll be a good girl, tread lightly, and keep that tongue on a leash. Relax. Believe it or not, I'm no stranger to tact. In biz or life. Can we close this? Great. <clears throat> 
Hey, there you are. This is V. She's here for that BD role. And V, this is Judy. Best brain dance editor I know. Enough already. You're gonna make me barf. Hey, Judy. Compiled your BDF. What do you think? Will it do? Still pretty raw, but yeah, ought to do. Mm-hmm. V needs to get deep inside. That's most important. That's what she said. So, let's calibrate. Tune it to her. Believe me, I've dealt with worse. Should see the jig-jig street porn we gotta contend with sometimes. So, we drop the inside? Let her look, let her rummage around, right? How about it, V? Raw brain dance. Ever taken a dip before? Uh... I think I could take think it. I can handle it. Let's just do this. Righto. Sit down. Settle in. And we'll get you going. Alright. Curious to see what this is. Or if it is what I think it is. to create your sensory profile first. Uh, sure. Okay, hit me. Just promise me it won't hurt. It won't. Not this time. What do you mean no, by that? Still, look at me. Gonna run the analysis soft. Should feel a slight tingling. Mm hmm Okay, now let's set the optics and other sensory six. Look smack into these two screens. Pretend it's an eye exam. Am I gonna have to do this calibration dance every time? Not necessarily, but it's worth the wait. Give me two more minutes and you'll see exactly what BD analysis is capable of. One more sec. Need to get the pain receptor limiters in. Okay. All set. I need to test your profile first. Tossing in a sample BD. You can use it to get to know the editor. Now let me see. Is it a BD of we... you? Can't you just use my recording? Why are we wasting time? So we don't risk our necks? Sides won't take a sec. Got something here. Should be perfect. Boot it up. Mm-hmm. Let me give you the tailored version first. Let you get your bearings. Then we'll jump into editing mode. Be diving in and three, two, one. Oh, that's right. Plan simple. Do nothing odd. Don't get creative. You go in, snatch the cash, get out. And we sell the BD to those psycho freaks from the studio. Got it, got it. And remember, everything on full blast. They'll spot us extra for a wicked adrenaline high. Uh-huh. Okay, on you go. I can't do anything. Down! Makes sense. Everybody! On the ground! I want to see you kissing the flooring! Money! Now! Or I will fucking drop you! I swear to God! Whoa! Yeah! Hey! Uh, uh, now! Before I blow your fucking head off! Ah! Slow, deep breaths. Your cortisol and adrenaline spiked, but the soft activated your hormone blockers. Nothing happened. You're alive and well. That was... too much. I felt... I could feel the guy's pain, his, his stress, his hope. Hope wrapped up in something else. Mm-hmm. Probably took a booster just before. You'll be fine. Got everything set up? Let's switch over to editing mode. Can I change things then, I guess?
I'll sever the link to the BD Roller's sensory array. You'll be able to look around freely. All seems yours. Full cam control in analysis mode, so move around, zoom in and out, whatever else you come up with. Think of it as your own little sandbox. So, analysis mode, you control playback. Can even pause when you feel the need. Then you use the editor console to unpause. Try it. Plan simple. Do nothing odd. Don't get creative. You go in, snatch the cash, get out. And we sell the BD to those psycho freaks from the studio. Got it, got it. Dream as hell, right? Well, that's not all. You can speed things up or rewind, whatever you like. Give it a try. Rewind. Roll it back to the top. All good. Snap. Now try fast forwarding a bit. Plan simple. Do nothing odd. Okay. You can also reset the recording. That'll take you right back to the beginning. Try it. Now for some fun. This here's why you came in the first place. In analysis mode, you get to view and even scan details of the enviro recorded by the BD roller. Focus on the heat. The gun this gonk gets from his buddy at the beginning. Now scan it. Uh... Plan simple. Do nothing odd. Don't get creative. You go in, snatch the cash, get out. And we sell the BD to those psycho freaks from the studio. Got it, got it. What's the screen that pops up? And remember, everything on full blast. They'll spot us extra for a wicked adrenaline high. Okay, on you go. Okay, right here. Both sections of the track indicate a scannable clue. The clue will be highlighted for a duration of the sequence if the editor is set to the correct layer. Clues may overlap each other. The spot where they overlap on the recording track will be especially bright. After being successfully scanned, clues disappear from the track. All right. Excellent. Let's move on. Now heads up. In analysis mode, you can ferret out background noise and conversations if the roller got close enough. This tech records everything, every little detail, even the sights and sounds the roller was never aware of. To see the sources of the recorded sensory signals, switch to the audio layer in the editor. Go ahead and try that now. Okay, good. Now you should see several sound signatures in the store. Choose one and hone in on it. Okay, fuck! On you go! Ah, little shitheads! Go restock. I'll take the register. How about you suck a bag of dicks, eh? So, any thoughts? Unbelievable. Seriously, like it was happening right next to me. Yeah, it's how BD recording implants work. They pick up everything, all the elements in the background. Then an editor tweaks them, makes them pop. Keep playing with the sound, explore it a bit. We'll move on when you get bored. Go restock. I'll take the register. And a How about things. you suck a bag of dicks, okay. eh? We have a deal today on two flavors. Cody and Down. Serpent. Everybody! On the ground! You wanna see your kids in the flooring? Money! Now! Or I will fucking drop you, I swear to God! Well then, where? Oh, I need to switch the layer, of course. Sometimes you can analyze extra layers in the raw. Stuff the roller's cyberware picked up. Like what? Ev's got Kiroshi optics that grab infrared, meaning you should be able to grab heat signatures from her recording. Huh. Hella nice. Scanning works on peeps, too. Walk up to the wounded chick. Try scanning her. 
All right, next thing. Scroll forward to the part where our artist gets a lead injection. A lead injection? Whoa! Hey! Now! See that? They shot him and he never saw it coming. But you will. Here it comes. My favorite part of the game. See the blinking thing over the entrance? Surveillance cam. Must have caught our shooter. You'll see in a sec. Cam feeds to the screen behind the clerk. Roll back to where the screen's in the kid's field of vision. Then scan it. Chumba shot him. Probably planned to all along. Must have got a nice slice of cred on the black market for a BD like this. BD freaks are ready to pay a preem for a real flatline. Anyway, if you've seen enough, you can exit. Alright, that was interesting. I didn't say much there. Yeah, it's impressive, right? It's too bad most of the BDs we do here are only good for flogging the log. Anyway, right. you ready to do this? Look at your wreck? I don't know. I... Ugh, let's take a break. I still feel like that kid when... <sighs> yeah. I think I'm done. V, there's no time. Get it together, please. Okay. Okay. <sighs> Go ahead. Just need T-Buck to link in. Whoa, 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 who? Runner for my crew, security specialist. She'll tell me what to look for while we analyze. No problem, I hope. Actually, it is a problem. Not what we agreed, Ev. Relax, Judy. Everything will be fine. You don't quite grasp the risks I took by letting you in here. What I'm risking poking around with this stuff. We're all taking risks here. That's the job. So either T-Bug patches in, or I'm on my way out. Judy, please. Fine. Call her. Let's get this over with. Hey, V. What's happening? Bug, listen. I got some useful footage from Konpeki Plaza. It's a brain dance. Konpeki? Oh. Uh, as much. Someone there with you? Yeah. Judy and Evelyn. They're chill. They're helping me work through this BD. Uh-huh. All right. You gonna tell me what this is about? Don't give me the attitude. Listen. Need your help. Got no clue what to look for once I'm in. All right. See if I can walk you through it. Jacking into your tech now. Mm, you've got to give me access. Opening port 1779. Secure protocol? Good, I'm going in. Should be getting my request now. Got it. You ready? A millisec. Okay, connection confirmed. Now some quick tip ice, and we're clear. Ready to dance. Fire her up, Judy. Ugh. I get chills every time I see this white ass screen. It's way too bright. RV, eyes open. Gotta find out where Yurinobu's keeping the relic. We're Evelyn now, right? Yeah, we are. Recognize those rings. You look like a cop. Uh. Did I scan him? Alarm firmware is fresh, but saw excited birds chirping on a BBS. Something about lots of seeds falling to this sieve. Let me generate keys. I can forge their six. Shit, camera's packed with new tech. Motion sensors, heat sig activators, IFF. You skilled enough to kill it all? Mucho more than enough. Just need access to their subnet. F 
fuckable meat, are you? Evelyn. Ew. She. I felt her fear. Sure got it under control quick, too. I said no. They'll have my head for this. Then you shall perish for a good cause. But uh, make yourself comfortable. I need a minute to listen in on that conversation, V. Could be something important. Mm -hmm. Finish. We shall see soon enough. My father's a tired, visionless old grey beard who thinks nothing will change. Right, I need to switch layer. My bad. And he'll live forever in his tiny yachty. I need a minute to finish. The program is still in the trial phase. We cannot take it to market as is. We shall see soon enough. Please speak with your father. He's taken a particular interest in this project. He can certainly explain the risks. My father's involved. a tired, visionless old grey beard who thinks nothing will change and he'll live forever in his tiny frozen bubble. I should not even be listening to such things. You will listen to this. Saburo is an adult despot, utterly removed from reality. Stuck in some fossilized vision of a world that no longer exists. Of a world that may never have existed. We have not seen eye to eye for the past 20 years. I am quite sure we won't now. Read the documentation carefully. The relic requires specific storage conditions. You must no, provide them. In Heard that? Relic docs gotta be around here somewhere. Look for them. Mm-hmm. It has is. We shall see soon. Here in a drone. Ventilation and cooling? Servers. Gotta be. Fancy doodads in here need to be controlled. All right, now let's look for the the pad when it's. Is that it? Last time. Bedroom, nightstand. I've got an idea. Be right back. Oh, we missed something. Right there. Or is automated turn oh, stupid latest scanner model. My bad. System is all connected to the server. Can you shut them off? Externally, no way. Gotta get in, check out how they link into the system first. Mm-hmm. Looks like all their security systems are linked to the hotel subnet. We need the flathead. No other way to shut down these systems. Can't get around them ourselves? Nope. At least I'm fresh out of ideas. Oh, got any candy left? Stuff was pretty fun last time. Bedroom. Nightstand. I've got an idea. Be right back. Very nice. But come here already. Just a sec. Looking for the perfect thing. Ah. Uh, You'll like this. Oh, she's changing her outfit? Oh no. Music? Of course. They're not that high tech. <laughs> oh god. Uh. A gun. Loaded. Safety's on. Good to know, though. Once you're in there, don't forget about that iron. Mm hmm. Manual details a special tip controlled container. Relic needs to be kept real cool. So chips gotta stay in the freezer. Yep, could damage it otherwise. Okay, switch on thermal layer detection in the editor. Should be easier to spot where your Nobu's keeping the chip. Warui Kome. Yeah. I missed this. Uh, you. Uh, um. I know. Oh, 
Okay. Aha. Oh, Donaghy's. Looks like Mr. Arasaka had something to celebrate. Really think you'll find the chip in there? No way. Tim's too low. Could fluctuate. Nice try, though. A minute to finish. The program is still in the trial phase. We cannot take it to market as is. We shall see soon enough. Okay, can do it from the distance. Right. Grab the heat sig. Matches the spec in the docks. Your Nobu's got the case here. Guaranteed. Mm-hmm. We got it. Good work. Looks like we got everything we need. Yes. Quit out of the editor. I speak with your father. It's one more thing, though. Taken a particular interest in this project. He can certainly... Just a fancy ass for you. Okay. Get everything you need? Yep. Yep. That'll do. Thanks, Judy. We got it. Later, T-Bug. Nice work today. See you soon. I'll wipe the cash on your data. You were never here. That means we need to recalibrate, Judy. Ugh, who's that? Creepy commercial. Keep it. I'll put it on Ev's tab. <laughs> Portable device for handling BDs. I already uploaded your calibration settings. Thanks, Judy. Not as sophisticated as what we got here, but should do the trick. And it keeps you out of harm's way. Clever. Speaking of harm's way, know what I see looking at you? Mm -hmm. Walking, talking corpses. That's not nice. We needed that recording, Judy. BD practically does our job for us. The BD will be the death of us. Seriously. If Arasaka finds out you have it, you're dead. I'm dead. Judy, relax. Nobody will ever know. Evelyn, please. No shortcuts. You go that route, City will always win. So be careful. Of course I will be. Besides, we'll talk in a bit. Bye, Judy. Thanks. V, one sec. Sup. Let's walk. Well, what do you think? You're not worried? Arasaka will flag and screen anyone who's had dealings with Yorinobu. Oh, they'll have a long list then, packed full of big names, much bigger than mine. You tell me. That makes who you they extra first. suspicious. Corpo hotshots and cutthroats, or a little bedroom plaything like me. You're smart. They know that, I guess. If they have any common sense. Well, what do you think? Intel on your Nobu, the chip, the BD from Kanpeki. When's a right? Plan's perfect. A job like this comes one in a million. Hmm. Thanks. Now the punchline, please. Just sounds too good to be true. What's the catch? Cold feet. Are you looking to get out of it? I want to know if you're really in control here. That you're not sending me into the sort of shit I can't wait out of. V. I have zero reasons to haze you. We're in this together. Really. Trust me that I got this. So? What now? V. Do this job for me. I mean me alone. No splitting the payout with anyone else. No middlemen. No decks. Uh... Um... I'll think about it. If I agree, there'll be hell to pay. For sure. I know. Whatever you decide. 
It stays between us. I can offer 50%. Eddie's enough to do whatever the hell you like. I'll be finished. Dex won't forgive a dirt move like this. Dex isn't the only fixer in town. But my offer's the only one you'll ever get. Let me think about it. Mm-hmm. If you need me, call. I'll send you my number. Thanks. Okay. Good luck. Now go. Thanks again. I need a few words with Judy. Yeah, okay. How things looking, Miss V? Uh. Turns out Evelyn's recording from Compeki was worth our time. Beautiful. T-Bug already called. Said she's working her magic. And the flathead. Nothing yet. On it now. T-Bug says no chance at that ship without that bot. To work then, Miss V. Did I mess up my uh, walking? Uh, I can't uh, normal run anymore. But um, that's where I will end the video anyways. When I restart the game, maybe it fixes itself. Alright. Uh, I don't have much to say right now. Uh, to be honest, I'm quite tired. I was already quite quiet for the last part of this video. So, oh well. I'm sorry for that. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. Hope to see you in the next one. Did I?